Hey all, Board Game Rants here where you'll find everything solo, tabletop gaming, and more. We got a special Father's Day edition of what's going on with my gaming this weekend. Do you think I'd leave you high and dry this weekend? Let's check it out. And by the way, I almost like high and dry this weekend. Either way, thank you for joining me. Got a big table out here. Cleared off. Work be damned. Just kind of shoved everything over there. And getting to you know, what kind of splayed out. Just the basics before I get into the expansion period. Kind of relearning the rules. Getting everything all laid out as such. Ah, this game. Very exciting. I just, this is, this game will never go anywhere in my collection. It has it all. And one of the more brilliant solo variants designed. Looking forward to finally getting into this. Long overdue. And approaching the table, not much has changed here. As you can see, nothing. Oh, okay, wait. Mmm, Imperium Legends has changed, has it not? Yes, Imperium Classics. What we got here, folks, is uh, quite potentially the best solo game that I've played so far this year. And I think I'm on game seven now. I think I played three out of classics, three out of legends. And I, I basically pick two and then I play it and then I swap. It takes a little while though to reset. This, this game is, like I said, I could tell after just a couple rounds of classics that it was going to be something that I was going to enjoy. I was right. Picked up legends, already digging into it. Uh, top solo game of 2021 potential over here. Lost Ruins of Arnak. This one is too likely going to make the top 10. I've played it out of the box and I've played it with some of the stuff that they've added online, leveling, you know, making it a little more difficult, which is a huge issue with a lot of players, including myself. Then they added the campaign. I'm on chapter two right now. It took me a couple times to pass chapter one. Very well done. Very well implemented got an awesome app for this so you don't so just save space oh man too many good games Rococo still genotype in the background uh let's see I sold one game I still got a couple on I think I put Ticket to Ride up um Shadows of Brimstone is just here because I was making room for Kyoto Wakan I'm running out of room I still got tons of stuff under the table I didn't get rid of well I'm not getting rid of Cloud Spire but <sighs> it never ends and for the heck of it, this Father's Day, yeah, we got the Father's Day beers going on. Hoppy Hop IP. I've not had any of these, which is pretty unusual. I, I've had a lot of beers, and but not these, uh, not these particular flavors from River Brewing, from Ho River Brewing. Anyway, Hoppy Hop is what I'm drinking right now. That is, uh, it's bitter and it's a strong one, ten percent. The bitter, the better. And we we're going to get into the dark stuff. That's right. Imperial Stout over there. Dizzy Izzy and Father Tsunami. Imperial Stout Ale. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. This one right here I'm saving for the barbecue. <laughs> so thanks for joining in. Uh, hopefully you got some Father's Day plans going on. I know I feel quite spoiled as a dad today. I got a very special family that's uh, well, we're just having a good time. I got some barbecue to do. I got some more beer drinking to do. Until next time, thank you so much for joining me. I'm Board Game Rants, and I'm out!